one in a hundred kids is born with some kind of heart defect. In our country, on birth, we fix it. But there are no pediatric cardiothoracic surgeons in Haiti. Our job is to go down there and surgically repair those hearts. You all know what that represents for Haitian children. This simply doesn't exist in our country. Alright, so what's the aftercare requirements for this child? The situation is not perfect. So we could, could face complications. But he's gonna die. I mean if he, we don't do anything, he's gonna die. So I need this discussion. We need this 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 discussion because we are doctors and the question is to do something or not. The operating room was not a usable room when we really began. There's nothing like losing power doing an open heart surgery to really get your blood flowing. Different pieces of equipment and attachments have become misplaced. We had so much stuff and we can't find half the stuff that we sent. Things are going to start getting a little more complex today. Mike, I still might need you though. Mike, I might need you still. Our effort here is that we're trying to empower Haitians to serve Haitians. You know, we don't live our lives by ourselves. In the world, we have to share capacity. We hope a little by little every day We've changed so much here that we've changed healthcare in Haiti and that the Haitians don't need us anymore. And that's where we want to be.